Hi everybody, I'm Easy Badfish, and welcome to another episode from the Primecraft server. <laughs> oh, we are out at spawn today. Uh, we've been back in the base, down, doing villager stuff for a few episodes now, and I needed to get some fresh air. I don't know about you guys, but uh, it's been really gray and really uh, underground for a little while, so <laughs> definitely wanted to get out here. And I'm out here because I want to build another shop. And... Uh, I think I want to sell some string. So I've got an idea, actually. I'm going to want to build just a fake little abandoned mine shaft coming out of this little hill here. But of course, this is not tall enough. And I don't want to build up here. I don't want to build another hill right here. Because uh, it seems like, you know, they've got it pretty much all leveled out. So what I am going to do is I think I'm going to dig down a little bit. And if I go down by two then I'll have enough to kind of replace this level, uh, well, kind of encase the whole thing in stone or, you know, whatever I want, and then still have a top of grass so that it matches with everything else. So I'll get my shovel out here and kind of take a look. Now, I don't need a huge opening, so uh, let's just kind of come out like this. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Sorry about that. I was AFK at my uh, at my gold farm. <clears throat> so I turned my sounds off because, uh, yeah, those zombie pigmen are pretty loud. What is going on down here? Why do I hear running water? Huh. Something down here? Oh, it's probably in a cave or something. <laughs> I'm sure we'll find it. Ah, uh, yep. Yeah, mm-hmm. Wait, what is going on right here? <laughs> That's kind of weird. Uh, let's just put that right there. Perfect. All right. So, let's dig this out a bit more. Okay, so that's dug out and filled in with grass. It's looking, it's looking all right. It's kind of weird with the straight line here. We can uh, work on the shape of this a little bit more in a bit. But for right now, I want to come over here and kind of take this. Uh, I think I want to do it in a 4x4. Four four, something like that. Because that thing itself is actually 3x3. Three three, but I need to make sure it's all the way enclosed with stone. and So I need to get rid of all this dirt so that I can put up the walls and make it look right. Well, this is interesting. <laughs> Not sure what's going on under here. Looks like just a cave, maybe, somebody broke into and just lit it up when they kind of leveled out spawn. It's kind of cool. Alright. So I'm not sure how far back I want to go. This is one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. We'll go ahead and stick that back up there. Let's get some torches in here. Now, I don't really need to go back too far. But I want it to go back enough, and I think that will be fine. So I want to, just for right now, we'll just seal this back up with stone. Uh, yeah. We'll take it all the way back. Just replacing this for right now. Ooh. Actually, that's a waste, because it needs to go like that. Two, three. Okay, so these need to come out as well. I wonder what's up here. Oh, good. Nothing. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess I am out of stone. It's a good thing I have a bunch of ender chests. Or an ender chest <laughs> with a bunch of shulker boxes. Sweet. Plenty of stone. So now what I need to do is actually fill this in so that I have a 3x3 three three area. How did I mess this up? 1, 2, 3, 4. Oh, duh. It would have needed to be a 5. <laughs> no problem. No problem. Um, we'll probably want to take this one in. Because this one, the ed there's an edge of the hill there. I don't want to... 
I don't want to break into that. So, grab my shovel out. Goodness. <laughs> okay. Now we can start filling the wall in. We'll probably add some uh, block variation at some point in here, but for right now, just gonna leave it as stone. All right, so now I've got our three by three stuff going on. What we need is our wood chest for sure. Let's go ahead and drop this stone back off. And we are gonna need oak fences and oak planks. I went and harvested a bunch of oak trees before I left, before I came out here for this. Now I'm thinking, I'll start the first one like here, maybe. Yeah, and then these go in here like that. Right? Well, that looks right, doesn't it? <laughs> it seems right. Um, but of course now I only have room for the. Well, maybe if I move this out a little bit. Go ahead and take these back. And then if I move it back just a little bit. So maybe like here. I didn't actually measure this out. Yeah, that seems about right. And then what I want to do actually is bring... Uh, off of one side, bring it out a little bit. Because you know how sometimes there's intersections that don't really go anywhere? Yeah, that's, I'm gonna build one of those in here. And it's just gonna be for decoration. It's not gonna go, actually go anywhere, of course. Uh, let's see. All right, so I kind of added this on here and went ahead and added these little cross pattern in here and that's so I can add one of these guys which I'm sure we've all seen I actually I hate these things I don't really know what they're for I guess they're supposed to be some kind of wood pillars but um, you know they're super annoying when you're trying to hunt through a mine shaft because you gotta like get like in the middle of the intersection just to see around the corner <laughs> I, I hate them but uh, I'm gonna leave that in here for sure let's see I wonder if I could add I don't feel like adding another one of those would really help anything. Uh, okay, we're gonna need to... Will these be enough torches? Holy moly, it's dark. <laughs> I even got a clock and I let it get dark. It's ridiculous. I've been sleeping in this bed. I don't know whose bed it is, but I've been sleeping in it. <laughs> Actually, I think this is a uh, Lego's dig for hire shop, right? Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the bed, Lego. Oh, see that? Zombie trying to sneak up on me. All right, back in here. Will those be enough torches? I don't think that they will. Actually, for over here, it looks fine. Yeah, I bet I could do, I mean, I know it, it It doesn't really look this way, I guess, in the actual things. I don't think there would be one this close to one of these intersections, but for my shop, yeah, we're going to have one. That way, we don't really have to uh, worry. And we'll put those there also. Actually, that's not necessary. So I think we should be completely... Spawn proof. I'm just checking my light levels. Yeah, it'll be fine in here. I'm mostly worried about right here. And that is fine. Actually, what's this corner? Nine. No problem. All right. So now I need some tracks. And I don't think I have any. As I think I left all the tracks I had. Yeah. I left all the ones I had left in the uh, villager trading station. To have there for when I need them. Alright, let me make some tracks. 
All right, got the tracks made, and we're just gonna lay them out like this. Just like that. Just have a, a line of track here, and uh, maybe have it wrap around like that. I don't know. They don't really do that, I don't think, in the game, but uh, that's fine. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. So now I need a couple of mine carts. Let me leave those, and... Nope, not the gravel. I want the iron. Okay, so we've got that, and I need two chests. Like that. All right, and now I need two minecarts with chests. Excellent. So that is where our inventory is going to be. So I'm thinking I'm going to have one here. So I'm just going to do like that. Oh. <laughs> Uh, it's kind of dark down here. All right, got all the string in our chests here. Oops, God, man, how does that keep happening? I did that with the string earlier too. <laughs> so, click on the chest. All right, one just string in here. So I want to put up a sign, and I think we'll say <laughs> we're gonna call it Stranger Strings. <laughs> uh, I'll just say. Two diamonds per stack. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a good one. Oh, you know what? I think I left my cobwebs back at base. So we're going to need to go do that. So I'm going to need to run back to base, grab a couple more things that I need, and then we'll come back out here and we'll finish this up. Okay, so cobwebs. I don't have a ton of these things, but I mean, I've got plenty for this project. So I want to put some in here, but you know, I don't want it to get, I don't want it to be too crazy. Hmm, maybe one up here, maybe some back here. You know what would be neat is if I could put like, well, I don't want to waste a whole bunch of them. <laughs> I was thinking I could like, Put like a room back here with like a piece of glowstone in the middle and then surround it, completely cover it with cobwebs, kind of like a spider spawner is. But uh, I don't know if I really want to do that. <laughs> but we could put some there. And I feel like there needs to be maybe like that. So you come in here. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Just have a couple. Maybe we'll put one right there. Yeah. All right. So that is fine. Okay. So now what I want to do is get some block variation going on in here. So we're gonna tear out some of these blocks. Probably not. Probably not too many. Maybe we'll make it look like a little andesite vein. A little pocket right here. Maybe put another one in there. And get some gravel in the floor various spots maybe have a little bit of gravel in here could work like that maybe a piece of andesite put some more gravel oops I I meant to do andesite there that's fine <laughs> doesn't matter that just makes it a little more random I suppose and uh, yeah I mean just doing little bits like that here and there nothing not really you know plan or a pattern or anything like that I'm just doing it I don't want to do it too much though I don't want to do it too much out here Maybe we can do a little bit of gravel. Maybe do a bunch of gravel right here. Where it kind of meets up with the... Yeah. I feel like there needs to be something right here. Oops. <laughs> I guess that's one downside to this shop. Is that these things can move around. Oh well. <laughs> uh... All right, so that's, I think, the inside pretty much done. Like I said, there's not a whole lot to this. It's just going to look, and that that's probably going to bother me. I just wish it would turn.
turn a little bit. Oh, not that much. That's, well now you're like, let's, can I spin you around some more? <laughs> hey, look at that. Maybe. Carefully. Nope. I don't want to break it because there's a bunch of string in there. Eh, that'll work. <laughs> okay. All right. Moving that thing around. Okay. So let's uh, get our grass back out. And I want to... I don't... I, I definitely want to fix this up a little bit. Just kind of help this curve out some. And then this can kind of... Hmm. Cover these up. Maybe make this kind of come out a little bit like that. Yeah. That looks pretty nice. Then you come down here. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder if I should even make this come out more. I don't know if that... I don't know if that looks right, though. Maybe we can even kind of do this. Hmm. I am going to need more grass. All right, so after building it up a bit and rounding it out a little bit and uh, playing with it some, I think that that looks all right. Uh, I'm still not 100% sold on this little area right here, but I can't really figure out why I don't like it. <laughs> so I think that's probably good for now. Uh, what I want to do is kind of connect... Well, I want to do two things with this path. I want to connect it up, bring it down here, but I also want to connect this path with this road up here. So... And I don't know if I want to, like... I think I do want to bring it down, like, right here. So kind of like this. And... We need oak slabs. I don't believe that I have any. Oh, I do. Sweet. So we'll throw these in here like that. And we'll just kind of continue to bring it along. Maybe like so. And this guy. Like this. Alright, so now we've got a path here and it's getting dark again alright so I think the best way to do this is probably just to continue it up where do I want it to meet up though I don't know if I like how this kinda digs way in like that let me maybe build this out just a little bit Maybe a little bit more. Yeah, it's a little bit better. Okay, so I will just continue this path going up here. Oh, I didn't need to do that because I actually the slabs are going to ruin those path blocks. Okay, so this path is in. It kind of comes down and curves around. And we go down into the shop here. I, uh, I realized I left some landscaping stuff back at the base. So I definitely need to run and grab that. And once again, get my inventory sorted out. And uh, yeah, I'm going to run and do that. And I'll come back to you once I'm back here. <laughs> okay, so I replaced the torches with glowstone and leaves. Grew a couple trees. Planted some bone meal. I uh, pulled up some of the flowers and some of the grass and stuff. But yeah, I think and this looks pretty good. I think and I'm uh thinking I'm ready to call this done. Now there's one one last thing that I need to do. And that is, of course, put my banner up. And I think I'll even maybe can I do something like this? Hehe. <laughs> 
<laughs> Stranger Strings. All right, guys. So I think that's my new shop, and I'm pretty sure that's all the time I've got for this episode. So if you liked it, leave me a like, leave me a comment, let me know what you think of the shop, and if you've got any ideas on anything I could do around the area or uh, anything you want me to build, you got any ideas? I'm open to suggestions. So, all right. Until next time. See you guys later. Bye bye. <laughs>